Hey guys, what's up? This is Konstantin and this is your favorite blog about self-driving cars. You see today I'm using uh, special equipment to help you to hear me better because I got just some feedback about bad sound. So let's use that better sound. I hope maybe not better video, but better sound definitely. Uh, so today I found an awesome news for you, which called that Honda to sell limited batch of level 3 self -driving. So let's start with this article, article and I will give my comments as always. So Honda said it will sell a limited batch of its flagship Legend sedan equipped with a Sensing Elite Level 3 autonomous driving technology that enables vehicles to navigate congested highways. So guys, it's a great news that Honda as one of the biggest car manufacturers actually going to sell car equipped with a system they call level 3 but I know it's kind of very very controversial what level they actually operate because some people think may think that it's level 2 they claim that it's level 3 okay I can explain the levels of autonomy no problem so it was a special scale created by society of automotive engineers and the idea of this scale is to define what level of self-driving technology we have in what cars but it's very simple it started with a zero level what mean actually no automation till the level five level five means completely autonomous car with no steering wheel where you can just sit and it will drive all the time with all condition and maybe you know it's kind of a vision for technology it's not real technology maybe even so maybe we will not have level 5 car like next I don't know 40 years or 50 years but we actually already have very developed level 2 or maybe as some company claim as a Honda level 3 car technology and it's already possible for example I believe that Tesla uh, autopilot is level 3 system so Honda claims that they also have very developed elite how they call it system which provide you an opportunity to drive under special conditions what conditions I will tell you right now so uh, when level 3 traffic jam pilot is activated in the system the driver can watch movies or use the navigation on the screen helping to mitigate fatigue and stress when driving in a traffic jam Honda said in a statement can you believe guys we are living in that time so now while driving in a traffic jam you can watch the movie and car will slowly move you, you, you in the car it's actually was so obvious for me for example and maybe for all uh, tech enthusiasts that we already live in that level of technology the only question is how to implement that technology in today's cars and Honda claims that they solved that thing and Tesla I believe they also solved that level of tasks so it's not like driving in a high speed so you just need to slowly move a car from one position to another position in a traffic jam it's so simple just do not bother i don't know switch on the car and move like 10 meters i don't know how many feet <laughs> not many feet i believe so this is the idea and that's what honda claimed the automaker planned to sell 100 vehicles 
not many vehicles, but it's probably will be their first experiment and they will collect all the data and they will provide better product on the next stage. So it's, I think, very, very good idea. And it will be the first step towards its goal to begin a first company to mass produce a car with level three technology, uh, I think worldwide, right? Traffic jam pilot option can control acceleration, braking and steering under certain conditions. It's actually this very well explained in the press release and I will put the link on the Honda press release under my video. Uh, by the way, subscribe to my channel. <laughs> uh, let's continue. It can also alert the driver to respond when hanging over the control, such as a vibration of the driver's seatbelt. And if the driver continues to be unresponsible, the system will assist with an emergency stop by decelerating and stopping the vehicle while alerting surrounding cars with the hazard slides and the horn. Yeah, very good idea how to, uh, what to do if the driver does not respond. Maybe specifically, maybe he just fell asleep or forgot about driving. I don't know, maybe he's busy doing something else. The car will slow down and just will park and will notify everyone else by horning. I don't know how you can sleep if your car is using horn. <laughs> The announcement comes after the Japanese government gave a safety certification to traffic jam pilot in November. So they have the necessary documents. That's, that's also great and awesome. Global automaker and tech companies including Google, parent Alphabet Waymo and Tesla have been investing heavily in autonomous driving. That's true. Many companies invest in autonomous driving as one of the best technology for transportation. And a lot of companies and people, experts, believe that that technology will change, will transform our mobility industry, what we have today, because today it's extremely inefficient, in my understanding. And bringing those technological solutions, we can change so many things. We can decrease pollution, we can make our roads safer. But what's most important, I think, is just make uh, driving better experience. People will not be nervous, people will be home, they will do their thing and car will just drive them. Perfect world in my view. Thank you guys for watching my video. Subscribe to my channel. I love you all. Have a wonderful day.